Cytokinesis is the process during cell division in which the cytoplasm of a single eukaryotic cell is divided to form two daughter cells. It usually initiates during the early stages of mitosis, and sometimes meiosis, splitting a mitotic cell in two, to ensure that chromosome number is maintained from one generation to the next. After cytokinesis two cells will be formed that are exact copies of the original cell. After cytokinesis, each daughter cell is in the interphase portion of the cell cycle. In animal cells, one notable exception to the normal process of cytokinesis is oogenesis, where the ovum takes almost all the cytoplasm and organelles, leaving very little for the resulting polar bodies, which then die. Another form of mitosis without cytokinesis occurs in the liver, yielding multinucleate cells. In plant cells, a dividing structure known as the cell plate forms within the center of the cytoplasm and a new cell wall forms between the two daughter cells. Cytokinesis is distinguished from the prokaryotic process of binary fission. Animal cell cytokinesis equals contractile ring positioning equals, during different, proliferative divisions, animal cell cytokinesis begins shortly after the onset of cystochromatid separation in the anaphase of mitosis. A contractile ring, made of non-muscle myosin II and actin filaments, assembles equatorially at the cell cortex. Myosin II uses the free energy released when ATP is hydrolyzed to move along these actin filaments, constricting the cell membrane to form a cleavage furrow. Continued hydrolysis causes this cleavage furrow to ingress, a striking process that is clearly visible through a light microscope. Ingression continues until a so-called mid-body structure is formed in the process of abscission then physically cleaves this mid-body into two. Abscission depends on septin filaments beneath the cleavage furrow, which provide a structural basis to ensure the completion of cytokinesis. After cytokinesis, non-kinetochore microtubules reorganize and disappear into a new cytoskeleton as the cell cycle returns to interphase. The position at which the contractile ring assembles is dictated by the mitotic spindle. This seems to depend upon the GTPASE rho A, which influences several downstream effectors to promote myosin activation, and actin filament assembly at a particular region of the cell cortex. Simultaneous with contractile ring assembly during prophase, a microtubule-based structure termed the central spindle forms when non-kinetochore microtubule fibers are bundled between the spindle poles. A number of different species including H. sapiens, D. melanogaster and C. elegans require the central spindle in order to efficiently undergo cytokinesis, although the specific phenotype described when it is absent varies from one species to the next. Seemingly vital for the formation of the central spindle is a heterotetrameric protein complex called central spindlin. Along with associated factors, central spindlin plays a role in bundling microtubules to form the spindle midzone during anaphase. Equals timing cytokinesis equals, cytokinesis must be temporally controlled to ensure that it occurs only after cystochromatids separate during the anaphase portion of normal proliferative cell divisions. To achieve this, many components of the cytokinesis machinery are highly regulated to ensure that they are able to perform a particular function at only a particular stage of the cell cycle. Cytokinesis happens only after APC binds with CDC20. This allows for the separation of chromosomes and myosin to work simultaneously. Plant cell cytokinesis, due to the presence of a cell wall, Cytokinesis in plant cells is significantly different from that in animal cells, rather than forming a contractile ring, plant cells construct a cell plate in the middle of the cell. The stages of cell plate formation include creation of the phragmoplast, an array of microtubules that guides and supports the formation of the cell plate. Trafficking of vesicles to the division plane and their fusion to generate a tubular vesicular network. Continued fusion of membrane tubules and their transformation into membrane sheets upon the deposition of callos, followed by deposition of cellulose and other cell wall components. Recycling of excess membrane and other material from the cell plate. And fusion with the parental cell wall, the phragmoplast is assembled from the remnants of the mitotic spindle, and serves as a track for the trafficking of vesicles to the phragmoplast midzone. These vesicles contain lipids 
proteins and carbohydrates needed for the formation of a new cell boundary. Electron tomographic studies have identified the Golgi apparatus as the source of these vesicles, but other studies have suggested that they contain endocytosed material as well. These tubules then widen and fuse laterally with each other, eventually forming a planar, fenestrated sheet, 8. As the cell plate matures, large amounts of membrane material are removed by a clathrin-mediated endocytosis, 7. Eventually, the edges of the cell plate fuse with the parental plasma membrane, often in an asymmetrical fashion, thus completing cytokinesis. The remaining fenestrae contain strands of endoplasmic reticulum passing through them, and are thought to be the precursors of plasmidsmata. 8. The construction of the new cell wall begins within the lumen of the narrow tubules of the young cell plate. The order in which different cell wall components are deposited has been determined largely by immunoelectron microscopy. The first components to arrive are pectins, hemicelluloses, and arabinogalactin proteins carried by the secretory vesicles that fuse to form the cell plate. The next component to be added is callose, which is polymerized directly at the cell plate by callose synthesis. As the cell plate continues to mature and fuses with the parental plasma membrane, the callose is slowly replaced with cellulose, the primary component of a mature cell wall. 6. The middle lamella develops from the cell plate, serving to bind the cell walls of adjoining cells together. Etymology and pronunciation The word cytokinesis uses combining forms of cyto plus kin plus cis, new Latin from classical Latin and ancient Greek, reflecting cell, and kinesis. See also, diploid. References Further reading, The Molecular Requirements for Cytokinesis by M. Glotzer, Science 307, 1735, Animal Cytokinesis, From Parts List to Mechanism by Eggert, U.S., Mitchison, T.J., Field, C.M., Annual Review of Cell Biology 75, 543-66, Campbell Biology, 580-582, more description and nice images of cell division in plants, with a focus on fluorescence microscopy, Naninga, Nan. Cytokinesis in prokaryotes and eukaryotes, common principles and different solutions.